先人の力を見せてやろうこれで勘弁しな俺を怒らせるなよ出し惜しみは何ださっさと終わらせるぞ俺が死の恐怖お前はここまでだお前の目は何も見えていないアマテラス Recording this, uh, I will uh, upload this separately. Now, let me show you what you think s that have changed for、uh, in the update. Like, first of all,、uh, the Shinobi menu is updated. Okay, so Shinobi menu is like this now. When you go to Shinobi,、uh, it used to have all those icons, you know,、uh, but now it's like this. Mission screen is pretty much the same. Now, Shinobi is like Shinobi list. Okay. And it shows more more of the icons than before. Like previously, it used to show like three rows, if I am correct, and three cross three, I guess it was like that. Now it's like a little compact. Now you are able to see a lot of stuff together. Also, one more good thing they did was inside this, for example, if you go to link board, now you can just、uh, someone else, let me open. Yeah. Now you can select. The whole path, like this, you know, the path which you want to unlock. Of course, you will have to still click on these, but you don't have to click multiple times. Just select the path you are trying to unlock, like this, and just click unlock, and it will be unlocked for you. So it's easier now. Of course, I would have wanted them to give like more, more option for so that I can select everything and stuff. But yeah, maybe they will do it later on. I don't know. Now you can just click on the path and highlight it and click unlock and everything will be unlocked as long as you have the materials for it. Now obtain new shinobi. Of course, it's empty now, but they have obtain all button inside this if you have pending. Now ninja card skin is pretty pretty bit change. I really don't like it, <laughs> but、uh, yeah, nothing you can do. Okay, now let's focus on this first. So now all cards will be visible. Okay, all cards. But if you want, like this is really good for people, for especially for AOM. So now you go to Naruto. Now all Naruto related cards will be visible. Now batch enhancement is also available. If you click on this icon in the below bottom, you see batch enhancement. Now, evolve batch evolve is also available like this. Synthesize is also available for specifically for Naruto. Limit break for Naruto. Cell for Naruto. So this is a good thing, I think, because it, you will get used to it. So you need. Uh, like you need some time. If you play for like two three weeks, then you will be like comfortable with it. Because、uh, I don't know. I have been playing for this game for like four years, so a lot of things have changed. And over time,、uh, over time, it gets like used to. You,、uh, you will get used to it. So batch enhancement and batch evolution. Batch enhancement is a new thing, I think, because、uh, like you can like multiple cards now and enhance them.、Uh, We didn't have that option to select every, all the cards and enhance them together.、We、had the option for batch evolve, but not for batch enhance. So this is pretty good.、Uh, you know, we wise cards are displayed here, so I think this is pretty decent. Now let's、uh, go for like everything I have covered here. Yeah. Let's go for Rista Squad. The screen is pretty much the same. Just the look is changed. This whole screen is changed now. So, yeah. So this screen is covered. Now let's go to notice and see what else they are talking about. Okay, okay. Obtain new shinobi. I already summon screen. Yeah, summon screen is changed now. You have like categories now. Limited time banners. It's three.、Uh, this image is now bigger, and the trial is smaller. The good thing is this item list now it shows at watch step exactly what you will get. So this is pretty good. Previously you had to go into details. Now details is available here. See details button. Previously you had to read all stuff like yeah from here. Now you will be able to see item list from here, so it's pretty good. I would say some little things they have changed. Drop rate is available from here, and summon history as usual is on the top. Exchange shop is all、uh, pretty much the same. Yeah,、uh, this is, and tickets all the. Ticket related summons are combined in this category, and other, of course, new voltage, new summon, and just the same. So yeah, this is the pretty much for the summoning thing. Now let's go to, uh, yeah, let's jump to 
pedal speed updated yeah so now previously if you remember we used to we had no idea what kind of buffs buffs we are carrying like especially invincibility was a issue because we didn't actually know like two second invincibility is gone now so now they are going to show icons on top of the shinobi not only your icon but also enemies and your squad so everyone will have uh, icons on their top of their heads uh, showing what uh, effects they have now these are the icons and these are the meaning for the icons so yeah you can just read it and uh, pretty much self explanatory now uh, improved auto function so this is the best thing i have seen and uh, this is the link board thing yeah i have already explained that so yeah this is the best thing the auto semi auto and the manual thing so yeah let me explain how it works so uh, go to any mission uh, for example i am going to go to my fortress because i want to show you a longer version of this so uh, let's take sasuke for example okay now there are three options let me show you what are those now this is manual in this you have to like control your shinobi and use jutsus and attacks on your own okay now uh, semi auto is basically the old auto in this the movement will be automatic but not the jutsu the user will not use jutsu what about auto let me show you what is auto okay now i am taking this just in case i don't die so auto mode see he is using i am not doing anything he is using everything on his own see hands are here i am not he is using jutsu on his own of course he is get stuck in traps <laughs> let me just free him from those so this is meant by auto so ultimate jutsu jutsu everything he will use on its on his own let's see of course this is not best for attack mission because now i am waiting for him to use ultimate but i don't know when yeah he used ultimate see <laughs> it's not the best but it's pretty good for especially for round up and stuff you know pretty good for round up and stuff see uh, this is my own fortress and i am not even playing <laughs> kind of a inbuilt auto clicker version not the best but yeah it works especially for missions like round up and stuff you know you cannot use it in sam only in missions like uh, attack missions and maybe uh, you know special missions and stuff not in not in sam that's just i wanted to show you that it is possible now to play it on auto semi auto is basically the old auto and manual is pretty much the same as before of course you can also use auto with your own hands so now the target hp bar is shown not exactly the count of hp of course and buffs are visible like what all buffs are and he, he can see everything like you even if you can't see anything he can see on all that fog and stuff uh so yeah that's pretty much like you can see the target oh, but uh, you are not able to see danzo for some reason only like naruto fs now one uh, one shinobi dies one enemy dies now you are able to see okay so that like you are also able to see the buffs on the both of the buffs enemy as well as okay so yeah, that's pretty much it for the update <laughs> it doesn't use ultimate only when it's necessary not all the time so yeah you have to keep that in mind uh one thing that i think is best with this is uh, you can combine an external auto clicker application along with the bandai's own version to get the best result perfect example of robots will take control of earth in future <laughs>